What is up guys, Zach Scott here playing Animal Crossing New Leaf and today, uh, well today I'm wearing a baseball hat for what it's worth. <laughs> it's raining too, uh, I don't know if that has anything to do with anything, but uh, here we go, <laughs> let's play. Uh, we uh, uh, don't really have many plans for today's video, joking, I have lots of plans, but they're all plans that you guys are probably well aware of. Who is this? Rod, what's up, man? I got a time capsule for you. I forgot to give it to you. This rain just won't let up. Clearly, the sun needs a little pep talk today, Purdy. What you need? Got the capsule. And here you go. It's to yourself from rod to rod. There you go, rod to rod. That sounds gross. Oh, you bought my brought my time capsule. Okay, I've been wanting to open it. Wow, a humidifier. <laughs> Did I really send this to me? Oh, there's a letter, too. Hey, future Rod, they tell me I always loved this as a baby, so that must mean you loved it too. Good thing you recovered our time capsule so we can go back to enjoying it. Your buff pal from the past. Aw. Rod to Rod. Haha, <laughs> I can't believe this doof actually wrote a letter to me. Heh, <laughs> I guess the doof is me. So true. I almost forgot. Since you went to all that trouble for me, I need to pay you back. Might as well give you what, what was inside. Seems appropriate. The humidifier <laughs> totally seems appropriate. All right, it's a humidifier. Let's bury another one sometime. That was fun. Yay, time capsules. Yay, time capsules. Uh, hopefully, I am seeing right now the effects of the beautiful town ordinance, and I won't have to water any flowers today. I can just freely go about my day digging up pitfall seeds, digging up fossils, uh, maybe dealing a little bit with fruits and other animals and stuff like that, and also maybe uh, finding that money rock. I, ima I imagine I'll find find the money rock I don't see why not just gonna go over here nothing do I have anything in my inventory that's interesting I think I bought a bunch of stuff uh, and I and I always forget to take I always end the video and I forget to, I forget to take it back last time you checked in we visited it in autumn town and uh, now here I am uh, in the in back in normal time summertime here in Astoria uh, there's a okay, Jacob's ladder and yeah, no, no flowers dying. That's pretty good. May I was freaking out a little bit ago when I had to keep watering all my plants, but it just turns out that the uh, the beautiful town ordinance takes a while. Cat, what's up? You're an uh, umbrella made of your ancestors. Hey, hey, Z Bear, running around the on all this rain. You got spirit. I'll give you that. Yeah, I'm not letting the rain beat me either. You inspired me, pretty. So, is there something you need from me? Let's chat. Hey, Z Bear, I got something for you to do. So. Will you bury this time capsule for me? I've written down my life's goals in a letter to my future self. But if I keep it around, I'm going to be tempted to rewrite it. So I'm going to have to bury it in the ground. And I want you to do the honors. How about it? Will you help me out? Sounds great. Cool. Thanks. Yeah, you, you got this. All right. Perfect. Going to bury a time capsule soon. <laughs> we'll just tuck it into your letter slot, okay? Bury it soon and do not open it, Purdy. All right. She's singing. She's happy. And I'm happy too. And this is the money rock. I still don't understand the concept of doing the whole whole thing because look, I'm getting him, I'm getting him. Unless maybe, oh, I think I just realized why the whole, now I feel stupid, I'm sorry. I guess you guys are right. Oh dear, I think I just realized why the whole. I bet you get three bags of money instead of two if you do the whole oh my gosh now i feel like an idiot but that's a, such a long time because i remember watching I, I just watched the video and i'm like that's the same amount that i got last all the time but maybe the whole gives you three backs i don't know i'll have to check that out on my own in the future because uh we're right now in the present and we're never getting this time back and so you should live your life like that and i'm not saying yolo but yolo <laughs> the uh the real the real lesson of yolo is not like in my opinion the real and for those of you who don't know yolo it's basically a uh it's popular popularized by uh drake and oh no i'm not talking to you, you probably want to move out or something okay i'll talk to you what's up i was reading a book about this famous flower bed the other day i think a story could really use one of those so i like to propose it as our next public works project I'll also let Isabel know. Would you please consider it, Zach? Yes, I will. Um, to me, is it be, anyway, YOLO was popularized by the hip-hop rap artist Drake and other people. Lil Wayne they even made a song 
about it. Uh, but that's fake. There we go. Knew it. Uh, basically, they, their their whole thing is you know you only live once, and so uh, the uh, the theme the kind of the uh, their message behind it is more like live your life to have fun and stuff like that. And then uh, of course the Lonely Island came out with a parody called Diolo, which is uh, again you only live once, uh, except there was more like very cautious like you got to like do everything right because this life is something you don't take for granted. And uh, furniture, buying furniture. Well, I got some stuff to sell. What I take away from that type of message, you know, the YOLO style message, or, you know, you only live once, or live your life to the fullest, that type of thing, is there's only so much time that you have on this earth, and you never know uh, when it's going to end. So, you should do things that make you happy, and make you satisfied with your life, and make you proud of the things that you've done in your life, and that way, uh, but make other pr people proud of you. Maybe not. I'm not saying you have to please everyone. I'm saying that like, do things that will make this world a better place for not only you while you're on here, but for others when you're gone. And that is uh, that's that's what I take away from that type of message. And I think that's a very valuable message. I think it's a very beneficial message. And so you know, as you as you age, and uh, let me sell this stuff really quick because I can't really focus unless I'm don't want to sell that. Blue Poker Racer 6 T, Big Bros T. I already have that. Pitfall, Humidifier, uh, Note, Peaches Parasol, that. Heroes Cap, Soccer Shorts. And there we go. Selling it all. That is everything. Crunch those numbers. Okay, almost 7,000 bells. It's a deal. Thank you. Come back with more anytime you like. Hey, it's Chevra. Did you want to buy a fossil? Oh, I, I didn't even. <laughs> I haven't even shown her yet. So. Take the time in your life. Don't get too wrapped up in other people's problems. Don't get wrapped up uh, in, in problem, with problems in general. Uh, do stuff in your life that creates memories, good memories, not only for you, but for other people as well. Uh, another thing. And I, I don't know if... Uh, hold on, I'm selling a fossil, so i, I got to focus on this. All right. Pay me directly. Yes. And this is meant to be an inspirational style message. This isn't like a downer or anything. I'm just I'm just saying, like, if you think about... Like, let's say... Uh, let's say you have a certain amount of money. And you can use that money to do whatever you want with it. Let's say it's spending money. It's free spending money. Um, think about all the stuff that you have bought in the past. And think about which expenditures has led, has really bettered your life. And I'm talking spending money, not necessities, because obviously necessities come first. You know, food, shelter, water, that kind of stuff. But what type of expenditures in your life uh, have have really enriched your life? Is it, uh, and, and that's it's going to be different for everyone. For me, when I think about you know the best memories I have, it's not necessarily the things that I buy that I keep around the house. It's things that I I do events that I go to, uh, travel that I've that I've done, you, you know, time spent with other people, uh, making them happy. Those are the fondest memories of my life. And uh, so yeah, every, every time I try to like, I buy kind of like a big budget item, like a new electronic or something. I say, yeah, you know, this might help me, you know, ease the boring moments of my life when I'm at home and stuff like that. But really. The, the money that, that is best spent, in my opinion, is always the ones that lead to new experiences and new memories. No, nothing here at the, at the police station. That's quite unfortunate. And again, that, that's going to vary for everyone. That's not going to be a universal thing. It's going to depend on what, what you like in your life. What uh, you know. So I'm not trying to give over, overly broad advice. Well, I guess I kind of am giving broad advice. And I'm saying, you know, whatever, whatever your experience is, just take note of that. Take mental note of that. And uh, on the chat... Yo, cool guy, this is short notice, but want to come see my place? I've got a lot of stuff I want to show off. Yeah, come over. I love short notice stuff. Woohoo, great. All right, what time? Oh, come on, I'm in now. I'm in now. Oh, I'm sorry, sorry, I can't make it. Suddenly you're scheduling stuff, so I can't make it. Well, next time then. All right. I hate it when they schedule stuff. Oh, there's another thing. There we go. Boom. Yeah, sorry, sorry to scare you away, little bug. But I got a fossil. Anything here? No. No tweet tweet. 
Yeah, let, me, let me go ahead and shake this tree for its oranges. And I know I've been leaving those perfect apples on those trees. Like crazy, but... Man, I just can't get over it. I can't, I, I can't motivate myself to do that. You know what I'm saying? And this is going to sound ridiculous. But if, if let's limit our scope to video games. What video game moments have been your favorite memories? Because I, I, I don't don't get me wrong, I am not down on video games. I'm not trying to to uh, to to speak ill of video games. I'm 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 being serious here. I'm not being sarcastic. Uh, there are several memories, fond memories that I have in video games, and uh, they're usually some of the some of the more memorable ones that have uh, stayed with me are ones where I've I've done really well in multiplayer events or. Uh, or just time spent, you know, just hanging out with friends while playing video games. And so, for me, it's it's being around other people, creating uh, memories based around those type of events, travel, video games, anything, really. As long as with, with, with other people, and it's, uh, I don't know, that's just, my, that's just my experience. Everyone has different experiences. I'm not trying to preach or whatever. <laughs> Got it. My dog is twitching right now. I wish you could see it. Is there any way I can, like... Is there any way I can just bust out, like, a camera really quick? Can I just, like... <laughs> can I just switch to the camera from here? How do I do... Where is the camera? Is that even possible here? Where's the camera? I don't even use this thing. Come on, where's... Uh, hold on. Is the camera, like, on... Like, it's, like, a camera button? It kind of is. Activating camera! Now, it's either gonna show... Uh... That's my dog. This is the, this is a really crappy quality camera for this. <laughs> the three the three DS. <laughs> I would better be off just taking. Look, her legs are twitching. That's what I, what I really wanted to show. Was her legs were twitching and they're like hanging off the chair. <laughs> All right, let's get out of here. Oh, that is ridiculous. Sorry, this is uh, this is a weird Animal Crossing video for me. Let's just go ahead and there we go, caught a butterfly. <laughs> oh man, I would have been better off just superimposing footage. Do I have three or four fossils now? What two? Okay, there must be another one somewhere. I, I'm always tired of not finding fossils all the time. Um. I'm all over the place today, I apologize. I'm waiting for my trees to grow bigger so I can chop them down. Anyone have a similar problem? Oh, now she's really twitching. Gosh, there's a rainbow. You gotta be joking, kidding me. There's a rainbow? Wow. Only a single rainbow though. No idea what it means. <laughs> oh man, memes from the yesteryear. There we go, there is another one. These are always so hard to find sometimes. What what item do I have? Well, hopefully I don't need that. You know, in fact, if I don't need that, I'm not going to carry it with me anymore. That'll free up an inventory slot. That's that's worth 20 grand in my opinion. I always Oh, well, there's another one right over here. Here we go. Yeah, I now I have four fossils. Perfect. All right, I'm going to go ahead and bury this time capsule. Uh, I like burying them up north in weird places so it's like obvious. Like if if I come back to it, like I'll probably bury it right here and not care. Let's go ahead and bury this time, time, uh, time capsule from Cat. Don't open it. Don't read it. I trust her. I guess if I ever, uh, she trusts me. She should. She's got to trust me. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. All right. <laughs> this has been a fun episode to film so far. I get to talk about things that I think about and that sometimes inspire me when, when I think about them. And then also I get to. Uh, I get to uh, show, whip out the uh, 3DS camera and show off a really grainy uh, shot of my dog twitching. <laughs> my dog Ari, she's a big one. She showed up on our front yard. Or ba uh, we, I always say front porch, but really it was our front yard. Um, anyway. Ooh. Ooh. Oh dear, pardon me. Welcome to the Astoria Museum. I may be of service. Assess a fossil. And then uh, I got like four, four things to assess. Oh, who? More than one I see. Please tell me there's a new one here. Oh, nope, they're all wonderful. In fact, you guys have them all and you would buy them if you only had the money, but you don't, so 
I gotta deal with them myself. And sell them. No, nothing else. All right. Let's go up here. Uh, just to take a peek, I guess. I really want some more space stuff, but you know, I only get so much. What is that? Okay, let me just check this out. What is that for? Well, no, I don't even care what that is, to be honest. Uh, you know, I think I have. I think I have most of the uh, special Nintendo items. I can't prove it, but I think I have most of them. <laughs> I can prove it if I took the time, but I I'm not willing to prove it. <laughs> is what I'm saying. I'm not. I'm not willing to prove that to you guys. Okay, let's. Uh, well, now. Uh, hey birds, let's go... What should we do? What should we do? Well, I got a couple things, a couple ideas here. Um, one, I could go learn a new joke, get rid of one of the oranges, and then go to retail, sell the rest of my stuff. And then next episode, focus a little bit more. I, I got a dream town already picked out that I want to go visit. And then um, uh, I, could, I could also do the coffee thing, obviously. Oh, we're not open for the day yet. Is there something you needed? I brought a snack for you, Shrunk. What kind of uh, emotion are you going to tell me today? What kind of joke makes him happy? Let's see. Give him uh, an orange. Confirm this orange. Here you go, buddy. An orange. Don't mind if I do. There you go. Ooh, that was quite satisfying. Well, thanks a bunch. I should probably return the favor now, shouldn't I? Hmm, then how about I tell you a really good joke today? All right, I have to get ready first, so we'll just wait right here a sec. Can't wait to hear it. This is going to be amazing. Thank you. Thank you, Dr. Shrunk is in the house. My old teacher's inspiration joke is sure to cure what ails you. Inspiration, guys. But I'm worried I won't be able to pull it off as well as he did. That's so funny that he's teaching me the inspiration joke. And I talked about, like, inspiring things. So here we go. Guess I'll just have to give it a try. Prepare to see emotion in motion. You shall now see inspiration in the very air. Uh, what was I going to do? I had a great scene that I just thought of. Oh no, what was it? Oh, that's right. Oh wait, no, I lost it again. Quick, turn off the lights. Okay, thanks. So yeah, what did you think? I think this is the first time you've seen my inspiration joke. Now you can add one more joke to your joke book. Use that joke book of yours to bust out your inspiration ability and develop your comedic skills. That sounds good. So let me, uh, let me, let me remove this hat. Remove headgear. Retail's also selling furniture. I could go get some furniture and try to offload it really quick. Uh, I think I have a little bit of stuff to sell. I don't know. I really don't. So inspiration, huh? So ignoring my goofy hairstyle. This is me trying to be inspiring. <laughs> instead, I look, uh, instead, I just look like a freaking nature. So let's just move on, and uh, we will go uh, to to retail. Try to sell some stuff. Oh, I almost dug that up. That's a time capsule. Here we go. Should I should I pop by my house and try to pick up a few things of furniture? I could. I don't even have to go to my house. I can go over to the the train station or whatever it is. So let's do this. Chevra's still here. Oh, hello there. Welcome. Thank you. Uh, yep. I want to sell. Brought in a lot of stuff. A couple fossils. Uh, pears. A butterfly. Two oranges. Two more fossils. And a humidifier. I don't really need that. I'm going to sell uh, Rod's thing. Crunch those numbers, baby. And 20,000. Oh, my gosh. That sounds really good. All right, I am gonna go grab my furniture really quick. No telling what she wants, uh, what what she's gonna pay for some of the stuff that I have. But anything that I have that could be considered furniture, I'm definitely going to sell it to her. Uh, now's a good time. Always go with the flow when she's buy when she's buying stuff like this, because you never know what to get. And sometimes life is like a box of chocolates. Literally, you never know what you're going to get. So YOLO. <laughs> <laughs> The rainbow! I don't know. Oh my god. I need to like get that rainbow thing going again. Hold on. So what would be considered... Like I don't really need the orange TV anymore. I already have it. Let's just check out what I have in my inventory. Let's see. Let's see. What is this? Block and block. Are those, do those count as furnitures? 
If so, I... Well, I, I want to keep two of them, so let's not get too hasty here. Fire flower, question mark block. Espresso maker, don't sell that stuff. Oh my gosh, I can't sell this stuff. Bill blaster, judge's bell. Weeping fig. I guess I could sell that. I don't know if it's... Foosball table, already have triple bananas. Colorful wheel. Dartboard. Makeup case. Glass display case. Display stand. Siphon. I gotta keep that stuff. Rocket. I already have a rocket. Game show stand. Anatomical model. Soda fountain. Uh, I could plant some flowers too while I'm at it. Uh, Astro lamp. Astro shelf. I have both of those things. Chase lounge. Robo TV, Robo bed. I don't really like the Robo stuff anymore. Hold on, what did I just drag up there? Come on. Makeup case, I'm selling that. Astro lamp. So you already have an Astro lamp, like a couple of them. You know what? I should keep one. Sprinkler, pineapple bed. There we go. More stuff? Well, I do know I want to keep the batter's helmet. Robo sofa, robo table. This robo stuff, man. And let me play a record. Uh, load in a new song. There we go. What a great song. Okay, let's go. Do 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 robo dresser, please. Robo sofa. Robo table. What do I not want to get rid of? Maybe the weeping fig. Uh, flying saucer. I already have a fly. Uh, let's see. Makeup case. Pineapple bed. Robo bed. Robo TV. Astro shelf. Robo sofa. Here, I'll keep the other astro lamp. For the flying saucer goal pole. Fire bar tea set. Soft serve lamp. One up mushroom, one up mushroom. Hearth. I have no idea what a hearth is. You know what though? Let me go ahead and put this watering bucket up. Cause who 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 in their right mind thinks I need it? Let's go put it like where was it last? I usually put this kind of stuff on like the last page here. Or wait. Yeah, right there, whatever. Close enough. Ogre mask, kitchen corner, computer. Another question mark block. Those things are so plentiful. Astro chair, tabletop game. Let's get rid of the question mark block. Actually, let's get rid of the computer. There we go. Alright, I have a full sla full stock of things to sell. I think this is going to make me very, very rich. Maybe not, though. It may not make me rich at all. But if it does... Look at this, look at this. Inspi it's time for some... Oh, I can't even put my shovel away. Alright, let's go ahead and... Uh, I mean, I can't believe there's a rainbow out today. I better believe it, though. Because it's happening. Whether I want it to or not. The rainbow's out. I can't put it back in. It was never in anything. It was just in the sky, I guess. All right. Oh, hello there. Welcome. Welcome, welcome. Thank you, thank you. I got some stuff to sell. Here we go. I do. Come on, let's do this. I run in furniture, of course. That's what you wanted. Robo table. Robo dresser. Robo sofa, flying saucer, robo TV, computer, makeup case, rocket, sprinkler, pineapple bed, robo bed, astro shelf, and uh, chase lounge. Wow. Crunch those numbers, please. You're paying a premium. Okay, well, that's not very much, but thank you. It, feel, it feels good to get stuff off your hands, out of your inventory. Uh, so anyway, guys. Uh, thanks so much for watching me play Animal Crossing New Leaf. Uh, it's been it's been fun for me, obviously. Come back next time. I still got some more plans for the rest of the stuff to carry out today, so that will be very soon. And uh, I want to somehow see this rainbow. How can I how can I see this rainbow? Oh my god, that is perfect. Hold on, let me see. Can I try on? Oh my gosh, can I can I try on something? Oh my gosh, that's a perfect thumbnail. <laughs> All right, goodbye. 
I'm Zach Scott. Subscribe if you have not. If you like this video and want to help this channel grow, all you got to do is click the like button below. Thanks so much for watching and check out these other awesome videos. See you next time.